Okay, let's see what it takes to create an image gallery. We'll go to, we right clicked, go to Widget Wizard, and in the images list, it's the second option, image gallery, edit settings, I assume. Okay, what do we have here? Two buttons. What are settings? Specify how you want your title and description text to appear using the controls below. Specify the size of your thumbnails, keep the original size ratio, or to set them to have an equal size. Um, <clears throat> I'll spend time on this later on. We right now just want to see how quickly we can create an image gallery. So let's see what it takes to add an image. Select an image. Oh, okay. From my hard drive. I'll just grab a couple of leading to X8 Pro. I guess normally you'd have titles and descriptions ready. You'd know what you're doing with your image gallery. Here we're just going through to quickly see how we can put one together. Remember, I haven't been here before, so I'm not sure what comes next. So I'll just call it uh, Advertising Amazon. Amazon. I won't type too much. Let's add four or five pictures. Grab another one. I don't know if it's the same picture, but I'll just grab that. Say Pro. five all together. So that's one, two, three. And another image. Grab that one. So it have bars. And one more. And X8 Pro other. I'm not sure what these pictures are, but no be really to X8 Pro. Oops. Same type. So, we have now added one, two, three, four, five images from my hard drive, and next I'm going to assume we hit insert widget, and there we have it. I'm going to stop this recording now so we can see how long it took, and um, I'll upload the page and then we'll take a look at it.